everyone welcome back to my channel I've got a little box today and it might be a little hyper because I'm on my third cup of coffee or is it fourth no I think it's third it just tastes so good <clears throat> I got a little package just a little one from FabFitFun it's not that big right <laughs> okay so this is the FabFitFun summer box and it is it the summer box? Yeah, it's the summer box plus my add-ons because, you know, it's like they have such great deals. How do you resist? And I hear a little girl who's supposed to be napping. Hold on. Okay. What was I doing? Oh, yeah. Okay, FabFitFun, $49.99 a month. Um, and I'll put a link below. I think you saved $10. Yeah, so you can get it for $39.99, your first box. That's how I did it. I just followed someone's link when I first started up because I'm like well I want to try it test it out and then I was obsessed fell in love with it um, and have gotten it ever since and then um, I don't know how many products you get you get a lot you get good stuff there's good products um, and then you can like customize some of the products and um, and then if you do a year subscription you it's what 179 so you save like $21 am I right on that so uh, so it'd be oops okay 179 I'm so bad with math so it'd be 44 75 a month versus in the 49.99 a month every month if you subscribe for a year and then there's like other perks with it you get like to do the sales and the customization all that stuff the add-ons not the customization um, like a day early do you get to do the customization early too can't remember but you get to customize more things now I'm hot maybe I should start drinking iced coffee that might be better has anybody tried that TikTok iced coffee I want to try that with like that you whip it up um, I haven't tried it but okay let's put the coffee down oh also I can send free starter boxes I've got like this I just looked online it says I can send it up to eight of them so if anyone wants a free starter box, I believe you get like three or four products. It's a $75 value and all you have to do is pay for shipping and handling. So let me know. All I need is your email address and then I go on FabFitFun and then I type in your email and then it sends you an email saying here's your starter box and then you put in your information. So you don't have to give me your address or anything like that. Um, but it, what it does is you get the free starter box, you pay the shipping and handling, and then if you like it and you want to continue, then it signs you up. So just know that if you don't want to sign up afterwards, make sure you cancel so they don't like sign you up after. Um, but anyways, and I don't, I never got a starter box myself, so I can't remember what's in them. I had somebody, I went and watched her video too, that I sent a starter box and she put a video up and I cannot, oh my God, I'm dying. I can't remember for the life of me what um, was in it. But all their stuff is always good, so. And I don't know what the shipping is. I guess it would depend on where you live, but. Okay, anyways, let's stop talking about it. And, oh, this is exciting. Okay, so, look at my box, look at my box. <laughs> okay, should I start with the box or should I start with the add-ons? I'll start with the box, good choice. Okay, let's see here. Oh, I made a list. I forgot my notes. I usually don't do notes, but I thought I'd try. I'll probably forget them. See, I didn't even look at my notes, and I already told you guys everything. Okay, so the box every month is different. Actual Fab Fit Fun like subscription. So cute. Um, if you do add-ons and have extra stuff, or if there's something bigger, they'll send it in a bigger box like this. But this is the this is the like box they send out. Let me set that to the side. Um, and then I guess they're always done by like a different artist every month. These boxes, which are really cute. That's probably the artist on top. They always give you a little. Excuse me too much coffee little catalog has all the products ways to use the products sometimes they do like women in business or oh this makes a good fan um, 
Anyways, Gabby Douglas on staying home but staying connected. There's just like articles and stuff and then what's in the box? It says these boxes are between $225.50 to $477 value. So even if you get like the lower end, and it's also based on what you choose, you know. Um, what's this? Discover Wine. Green Chef. I've tried one of these, not Green Chef, I think I tried Home Chef, and I actually liked it. The food was so good. My family was really happy with it. Okay, now, I feel like we hit in a candy store. Okay, let's see. I can't remember, um, oh, sometimes there's a choice and you can add an extra one. So like, okay, let's see how they did it this time. Sometimes it's kind of hard. One, A, B, C, D. Okay, so all members got to choose. They could get this drawstring bag, draper, not drawstring, straw bag with floral scarf, a towel, a wireless charger, or the Pottery Barn little incense thing that diffuser not incense and so I chose I chose the bag don't know why I don't need a bag but it was cute um, I just thought it was really cute so I chose the bag this is what she looks like it's really nicely made like really nice made nicely made got these little straps so it's like big enough to go over your shoulders got a little scarf which I guess you can leave it on or you can untie it, put it in your hair or around your neck or I don't know what else you would do with the scarf. Um, and then inside is like lined with a blue liner. It has um, a big pocket here and that's it. That's really cute. I only, I wish it had like one more pocket, but that's still super cute, especially like summer, you know, summer vibes. Okay, so this bag, is the Draper James straw bag with floral scarf. It says um, $75 value. Crazy. Okay, and so there are two items I wanted. Actually, this was probably my number one choice. That was my second, but I wanted both. So I paid an extra $15 to get the second item. This is the L Space tie-dye towel. And if you can't tell, I'm a little obsessed with tie-dye this year. I kind of always have been so and it's so cute um so this towel says pastel blue purple tones boho chic $58 and it is so stinking cute and look it has this like fringe on the end okay I mean it's a good sized towel can you see it can you see it it's pretty big oh it's so cute I just gotta keep this from my kids because they're gonna steal it from me. Okay, I mean, they can use it just as long as they don't ruin it. I'm kidding. Okay, so those are, that's my first. Now the second, and all members got to choose what they wanted. The second option here, this is a little better. A, oh, one A, B, C, D, E, oh, okay, I, there was two more, there was also, so this whole page is the first, you could have got one of those four, or the Dr. Brandt Do Not Age uh, Triple Peptide Eye Cream, or the Lashes MD Eyelash Conditioner, so I guess those were all, I just didn't finish, um, choice number one. Now, choice number two is also all members. You can get a Michael Kors Passport Wallet, this Business & Co. Pleasure Cooler Bag, the Hydropeptide Moisture Re Reset Face Oil, um, the Isaac Mizrahi Blue & White Kimono, which is really cute, and if I was shorter, I'd probably go for it, but I already know because I've tried stuff like this. I'm so short, it looks like I'm swimming in it. Um, 
And the last option would be the R & Co Television Perfect Hair Shampoo and Conditioner, which I haven't tried this, but it's got, I've heard it's like really nice. It's got some good reviews. So, um, what did I choose then? Did I choose that? I can't remember. I wish they had like numbers, like one, two, three, four. <laughs> Um, what is it? Oh, okay. So I chose the pept the oil. The Hydropeptide Moisture Reset Photo Nutrient Face Oil. Facial oil, because I really like oils. Um, this one, it says made with pure plant oils and rice brand extract. Retails for $120. It better be the best stuff I've ever tried. <laughs> and it's a glass bottle. So I just, I don't know, I was re I think I read the reviews on it and even though I don't really need any more skincare because I have too much, it just, I couldn't resist. It just had good reviews. Um, it says it's an antioxidant rich blend of dozens, of a dozen precious oils locked, it, locked, locks in moisture and helps protect skin from environmental stressors and free radicals, pure plant oils, plus soothing rice bran extract throughout uh, thoroughly nourish and support your skin's natural lipid barrier. It's hard to read because it's got like a sheen to it, so if you turn it a little, then it, yeah. Um, let's see. Gently swirl bottle before use. Dispense three to five drops in hands. Uh, you gently sweep, use a sweeping and patting motion to apply oil all over face and neck. AM and PM. Cool. So, we'll be trying that tonight. And then... Because I kind of wanted this, but then I didn't really need it, and I kind of kept going back and forth. I thought it was cute. I went ahead and added the cooler bag, and it was only 15 bucks to add this. So this is the Business and Pleasure Co. cooler bag. Uh, it says premium cooler bag keeps food and drinks cool and crisp. It retails for $59, and I kept seeing um, them doing spoilers for this one, and so I don't know. I'm not even like a yellow person, but I just thought this was so adorable. Um, oops, so there's the bag, let me open it. I like it has little handles right here that has snaps on it. So you can keep them together. And then it also has the adjustable strap. So you can make this, you know, longer, shorter, and the little shoulder pad, which is nice. And this is a really good quality. It feels really like tough and thick. Okay, so inside, this would be great for like going to the beach, even though I don't live near the beach, but you know, a couple hours away, going to the, the park, the lake, whatever. It's just a good little, it's all lined, and I know it kind of looks small, but I feel like you could fit a lot in here. I think I could easily fit a 12 pack of soda or beer. <laughs> um, inside of this. Of course, my mind goes to soda. Cherry Pepsi. I'm thinking, how many Cherry Pepsis? One, two, no. Um, and then does it have a pocket? Oh, and then it's got a little pocket. I don't know what you use this for. Maybe stick your phone or some napkins. But really cute. Really nice quality. Really sturdy. So I really like that. I can't wait to use that. If I ever get to leave the house to do anything other than run an errand. Okay. The third, so that was um, second option. The third option, also, um, all members got to choose. So you could have gotten this Giving Key Mini Key Necklace. You could have gotten the Kula Mineral Face Organic Matte Finish Sunscreen Lotion, which I like Kula. I have, I've had quite a few Kula lotions. Um, or the Kula Mineral Face Matte Finish Cucumber Sunscreen Lotion. They said this one is for Canada only, and then this one is for US only, so it depends on what um, where you live. Or the Tom's Sydney sunglasses, which are cute, but I know I can't pull it off. I'm not that cool. <laughs> um, then uh, the fourth option is the black peel-off mask and hydrogel eye mask with hyaluronic acid set of five. And then the last option would be the Kate Somerville Goat Milk Moisturizing Cream. And, oh, three, nope, and there's one more. The last one is the Dry Bar Prep Rally Prime and Prep Detangler. Okay, so I don't remember 
what option. Okay, now I do. So I don't need any moisturizers per se, but I um I got this Kate Somerville, which is supposed to be just a fantastic brand. It's the Goat Milk Condition and Restore um, Moisturizer. Soothes and moisturizes moisturizers. So she writes, growing up with eczema, my mom would put goat's milk in my bath, use this cream daily to help replenish and nourish the skin. Um, this got really good reviews and ratings. Ratings, review, same thing, right? And so I really wanted to try try it. Ooh. It's very like drippy. It's thin. Which is fine. It's more of like a like a water base maybe? I, is that what they're called? It's like thinner, which actually I think it would be nice and cooling if you stuck it in the fridge. I'm actually excited to try this. So then they gave us 20% off and free shipping on orders $85 and more, katesomerville.com. If anyone would like that code, let me know um, for 25% off and free shipping. And I'll send it to you because it's like a specific code. Um, this says it's made with lactose from goat's milk, jojoba, and avocado. A gentle formula instantly absorbs into the skin for a healthy glow. And it retails for $65. Okay, let's see next. And those two first things, those are the only add-on or additional like choices I added, but then I do have a bunch of add-ons too. Um, okay, so this next option is only for select members. So I think you have to be a year uh, a um, yearly subscriber, and then you get to customize these options. So there was a Zoe Ayla ice roller. I have one of these. It's so nice. I mine I got on Amazon though. A silked satin pillow sleeve. I did not get that because I have king size pillows and they're always just regular. The Isaac Misrahi Loves XO Sienna Vase, which is really pretty. The The Lifestyle Co. Beach Mist. The Amica Brooklyn Bombshell Blowout Spray. Or the Grace and Stella Hyaluronic Acid hydrating serum and I, I considered the vase because I thought the vase was really cute but um, I didn't really have a place for it and I wasn't quite sure the beach mist I already have a lot of hair stuff even though I don't know I thought about the beach mist I don't need any more serums even though I like them so I went with the Amica Brooklyn bombshell blowout spray and part of the reason why is because I knew that if it if I, I don't care for it I, my sister, my daughter, my niece, my other niece, my other, like I know lots of people that would probably love this product and I know Amika is a good brand so I kind of wanted to try something different. So I went with that. Um, it says give your hair incredible volume, texture, and body with this lightweight spray, $25. Okay, the next, uh, the, okay, everything else that came in the box is actually FabFitFun's pick. So we didn't get the option of choosing these ones. So, the first thing I have here is by Winky Lux Unibrow. It says it's a Unibrow Universal Eyebrow Pencil. I like Winky Lux's um, packaging. I've gotten some like lip balms from them and they're so cute. Uh, it says, get the best brows ever with this universal brow pencil. Retails for $16. I believe I've actually gotten this in something before. So I'm probably not going to... Ooh, well, that didn't work, right? Okay. Oh, it unscrewed. Right? No. Okay, so on one side is the pencil. I didn't touch it, but I'm not going to... I don't think I'm going to keep it because I have other ones and I don't even use them. And then the other side is the spoolie. And I like that it came in a packaging. You know how sometimes you get um, products from companies and they don't come in like the original box and stuff? I don't know. I get it because you know, then they save the money. They don't have to do that packaging. But I like, I don't know. Even though I throw it away, I kind of like when they have it. Um, okay. Then the next thing we got is the Spongel Hand Cream in Coconut Verbena. 
I've never tried a sponge gel hand cream. So this says, nourish and hydrate your hands with a blend of hyaluronic acid and shea butter and macadamia seed oils. Retails for $18. I kind of, you know, I'm gonna use it. I kind of want to give this to my brother-in-law because he just had surgery and um, he really likes lotions, especially like good smelling ones. Ooh, that smells good. That smells really good. I really like that. I think I need it in other places too. And it feels like a little goes a long way. Like it's nice and moisturizing. Look at this, I got a bruise right there. Do you see that? I get these bruises, I don't know where they come from. I don't even feel myself bump into something and then all of a sudden, bam, I'll have a big old bruise. I mean, that one's not that big, but usually they're like way bigger. Okay, so we got that. Hopefully I'm not allergic to it. Next thing. Ooh, Tarco foot cream in Sicilian blood oranges. That is nice. Cali Cosmetics foot cream with menthol and Takaro, which I have a Takaro um, lotion that smells really good too. It says it's a combination of menthol and olive oil helps to heal and hydrate your feet. I definitely need this right now. Um, $24. I don't want to put it on my hands because I'm not going to pull my foot up to the screen, but we're going to test it out and see. Ooh. Ooh, I like the smell. It smells, it smells like blood orange, which I love that smell. Okay, so there's that. Is there another page? What am I missing? Did I miss something? Oh! Maybe I did add something else on. Um, additional. I'm perplexed. <laughs> so I, there's a product in here that was from the fourth option, but I got, I, I had picked the, um, oh, okay. I split things up. So the fourth option was Terra May Aloe and Tea Tree Toner, the ice roller, the pillowcase. That was the fourth option. And then the fifth option, they're just the same color, was the vase, the beach spray, and the Amica hair stuff, and the serum. So I also, this was one of my picks. And this is, I haven't tried much from this brand, but it's Terra May Aloe and Tea Tree Toner. And I really like the packaging, it's cute. Um, oh, that's nice. That is so nice. They wrapped it up inside the thing. Ooh, it's a glass bottle. Ooh, that's so, it looks so sleek and nice. Um, I really like toners a lot, like probably more than I should. Um, and this, it says, reveal your best skin, yet as aloe and tea tree uh, combo soothe skin and slews away the dead skin cells. Retails for $54. Okay, I've gotten so many good things in this so far. Um, and then the other two things, let me get that out of my way, that I could have received. Um, so th these last couple things were like FabFitFun's picks. So they also had a Murad Essential C Cleanser you could have received. They had the Wander Beauty Baggage Claim Gold Mask in a six pack you could have received. Um, you could have received a Makeup Drop Hybrid Makeup Applicator. And then they had a Riddle Oil Original Roll-On Perfume. So those were other options, but I received these three. Or, or yeah. Because um, I, I guess they do like mix it up. And now let's go on to my add-ons. Now that I'm already on here for like 24 minutes. Hold on one second. Let me get Okay. So, add ons. They always have add ons that you can add on, and they're like ridiculously priced low. Like, they have such good prices. So, I've gone overboard quite a few times. I tried not to this time, but you know. Um, so, the first thing I picked up was this Barbarella Bling Brush Natural Jewelry Cleanser. Okay. So, this is like a brush says clean jewelry on the go okay so it says 
Remove cap, twist bottom of bling brush to release formula. Clean underneath your stones and brush the outer, uh, the outer details for a flawless finish polish with any dry fabric. Do I have any dry fabric over here? I got a sock. <laughs> okay, so this is what it looks like. And okay, this is where you twist. So this is what it looks like. It's like a little brush. And I guess you, okay, I feel like a liquid. And so I guess you just, and the reason why I got this is because I haven't gotten my ring cleaned in a long time. And I thought this would be good because it gets underneath. See, I don't know. I'm gonna have to do it like with the light because I can't really tell if it made that much of a difference to be honest. Um, we'll play with it. I still like the idea. I really like the idea. Um, so I picked this up. This was $7. So I figured it was worth a try. And then the next thing I picked up are these Hero Cosmetics uh, Mighty Patch Invisible. 39 patches. I wonder why it's 39 and not 40. That's kind of an odd number, but they're um, for blemishes. This was $7. I think these are like 25 bucks if you, um, if you end up like buying it regular price. And it looks like they had two different, they have two different sizes, which is kind of cool. So it's hard to see, but in here, see these little like little round sticker thingies. So like you have a zit, you put it on at night after you clean your skin and you leave it. And then in the morning, it's like white in the stuff, in the center of it. And it like sucks the stuff out of the pimple or something. I don't know how it works. I know it's good. I know anytime I've ever gone on a trip, I make sure to get these or bring these because I don't know what it is, but when I change climates, not climates, when I go to different areas, I always end up breaking out, always. Like I'll go on a trip and then all of a sudden a pimple will pop up and I'm like, man, and that's when you're wanting to take pictures and stuff like that. Um, but anyways, maybe it's stress. I don't know. So these were $7 and then we picked up this, oh, I'm going to use this tonight. Oh, I've been wanting to do one of these for like weeks now. It's the Voish, Voish, New York Collagen Hand and Foot Mask duo this was five bucks so it was like 250 each which is a pretty good price for masks um, one is for your hands and then the other one is for your feet and so and it's has cannabis in it right it's our cannabis sativa seed oil um, dermologically tested and I, I wonder how long. So the hand, it says you just leave on five to 10 minutes. And the feet, clean feet, put on socks, leave five to 10 minutes, tear the tips of the socks along with the pre-cut line, repair nails, blah, blah, blah. Oh, okay. So I guess you can like the, like the tips of the sock part, you can pull off so you can paint your nails if you want. So like you can do a whole treatment. Um, I just, my skin is so dry. So I don't know, like sometimes, some of these I've tried before, they make your feet peel. Uh, let's see, it says enriched with plant-based collagen, hemp seed oil, and eucalyptus extracts. This ultra rich and nourishing cream delivers an intense dose of moisture to visibly restore youthfulness. The unique blend of hemp seed oil and collagen instantly soothes and calms the skin, bringing comfort, softness, and freshness used for uh, pedicure services and relaxed hair feet. So I don't think these make your skin peel. They have some where like your skin like a week, a week and a half later starts peeling off your feet. It's kind of gross, Ugh. but it like refreshes and renews everything. I was scared to try them at first, but I don't think these do that. But I am excited because I really need some kind of like pedicure treatment or something because I put lotion on my feet and they just, I don't know, I guess it's like a summer thing, not to gross anyone up. I can't stand my feet to be dirty. Oh, can't stand it. And I can't stand like if they're getting any dryness on it. It just, it, oh, I just hate it. It just, ew. um, yeah, not good. So 
that's one thing I do usually do. I go get a pedicure like every three, four months. I don't do it all the time, but if I can, I would go every like three or four months or something like that and it makes a difference. I just, my feet feel so much better. <laughs> okay, next thing I bought, okay, this was $18. This was the more expensive option of my add-ons, but it was worth a lot more. I can't remember how much though. Um, it's a Miami Beach Bum Vanilla Orange Bum and Body Cream. This company got a lot of good um, reviews. So it says oregano and pearl infused bum and body cream. Um, it says where, where, whether you're stepping out of the waves or simply out of the shower, massage Miami Beach bum cream in circular motions for a blemish free bum and body. <laughs> So I don't know. I just it got. A, I was looking at this and I went back and forth and I was like, do I want to spend eighteen dollars? But it seems like a lot. I mean, it's a nice big tub and it got some really good um, reviews. So and like I said, my skin has been so dry lately, especially my feet. Oh, it smells good. It's like orange, orange and vanilla. I don't smell any oregano. So the oregano must be, well, oregano has like anti-inflammatory properties, I think. So, or antibiotic, no, antibiotic properties. So um, I guess that's good for your skin. Okay, the very last thing I added on was a mystery bundle. I always add a mystery bundle on because, you know, I always get good stuff. They're $29 to add on. Um, and I've, I always get good stuff in here. I've gotten like Murad products before. Um, I've gotten like cute, I've gotten like travel stuff. I've gotten, I think I got like a cute purse last time, which I haven't even used yet, which I don't know. I might end up giving that to someone, the one I got the last time, cause I don't, um, I just don't use it. It's super cute though. Can I even get this out? I don't know why I have a thing. I don't like destroying packaging. <laughs> I'm weird. Okay, so. First thing in here, what is this, like a scarf, maybe? Oh, let's open it up and see. Pink, white, one size. I think it's gotta be a scarf. Ooh, it's soft. It's almost like, feels almost silky, but it's not silk, it's like cotton. Um, Soleil is the brand. Retails for $88. Maybe that's why it's so soft. So I'm thinking it's gotta be a scarf. Yeah. Which, I mean, it's cute. I don't know if I'd use it, but it's it's actually, it's so nice. It's really nice. Um, I just don't know how much I'd use it. What is this? It's 100% rayon. It feels so, so stinking soft. Um, I love scarves like this. I just don't use them. I gotta think of another use. Like maybe like put it on a shelf as like decorative. Anyone have any suggestions? I don't know. Okay, so there's that, $88. So that's already pays for the whole um, thing here. The whole, what's it called? Mystery bag? Mystery bundle. Okay. Next thing we have, looks like a two pack, is Percy Nobleman Face and Stubble Moisturizer, Face and Stubble Wash. That is cool. So they give me a men's product, which is kind of cool. Um, let's see, Percy Nobleman, the Face and Stubble Wash is a blend of the finest ingredients formulated with natural cleansers derived from coconut, our face wash. So it's just a face wash, beard friendly, won't conflict with your grooming routine. And then the moisturizer is just a moisturizer. Um, FabFitFun has a men's box too, in case you're interested. So this is what the wash looks like. Um, I'm not going to open it because I probably won't use it. Um, I gotta ask my husband, he might use this, I'm not sure. And then this is the moisturizer. Um, if he doesn't, I'll pass it on to a friend of mine, or my brother-in-law probably. But, um, I don't know, my husband's so weird about stuff, like, he'll just wash his face with soap. He won't try other stuff. Okay. Next thing we have is routine natural deodorant. What? 
So it's super, for the times you get nervous and you want to stick your hands under your armpits, but then you remember this routine has charcoal, magnesium, and probiotics. What you put onto your body goes into your body. Okay, Sister Nigel and Pippa created routine because they believe that just like the rest of you, your armpits are glorious and those vital lymph nodes deserve the best. That is why there is only clean in your routine. So get up there with those pretty digits and best delivery method, the best delivery method for our product. Oh, so your fingers. And spread some routine love knowing root, uh, wait, spread some routine love knowing routine spreads the love back into your community. Support people and animals big and small. Made at the base of the Canadian Rocky Mountains, this large jar is life-changing. Cream will last you three to six months. Tested on friends, never on animals. <laughs> Love that. Um, let's see. Gently smooth half a jelly bean size amount onto your armpits and other stinky areas. If you experience underarm sensitivity due to the baking soda, try our baking soda-free formulas. Uh, it contains activated charcoal. So, oh, that bottle's nice. This is the, the container glass. I've always wanted to try one of these, but I'm kind of scared. So this is what it looks like. Should I do it? Should I do it? Half a jelly bean size. That feels like too much. It's like, it's very liquidy. Not liquidy, but it's like a lotion. Okay. I'm not going to put it on camera, but Okay, so I have a weird thing about putting, like, with deodorant. I'm only going to put it on that side because I might not like it. I don't like that sticky feeling. So it depends on how this dries. If it's, like, sticky, you know? Like, I've tried some where I just feel sticky. I won't use it. But I've always been so curious about this kind of deodorant. I've never heard of this brand, though, so that's exciting. See, I always get good stuff in my uh, mystery bundles. Okay. The last thing in my mystery bundles is Xur Shave Gel. Aloe Vera Shave Gel. You know what's funny is I was just the other day thinking, I wish I could get some kind of like shave, shave, uh, shaving cream, shaving gel, whatever in a box because I wanna try a new kind. I found one on um, Amazon that I like that I've been using, but I wanna try something different. And that's something you don't usually get. Um, I had, like a lot of them in the stores I'm allergic to, they, I don't know, I have to use the sensitive ones or I use like the men's shaving cream, um, but for sensitive skin because the women's always have all these crazy fragrances and that doesn't work well with me. So I'm assuming this is a men's. Aloe vera. I wonder if it has scented. Um, wet face, apply evenly the shave area, shave, rinse well. So I'm gonna try it on my legs. Yeah. I'm actually so excited about this because I got a shave gel that I, I've been wanting one. I've got the deodorant, which I've been wanting to try this. I mean, the men's stuff, I was kind of surprised they put the men's. I mean, I don't mind. I don't mind because I do have men in my life, but I, I'm kind of surprised they put it in the women's mystery box, you know? I almost feel like maybe they, because even this could be men's too. So it's kind of weird that they did that. Um, and then a scarf. <laughs> but I'm not complaining. I'm actually really happy with this box, really happy with my add-ons. Um, so I'm curious, what did you guys get? If you got um, FabFitFun, what did you guys pick? Did you get any goodies that you were excited about? Are you happy with your box? I'm super happy this month. I'm s I am can't wait to use the towel. And it's funny because I'm not much of a swimmer. I mean, I can swim. I have no problem swimming. But I remember when I was a kid, we moved into a house with a pool. But we had houses with pools when I was younger too. But I was um, junior high, I believe. And I remember the first summer, I swam all summer. And then after that, I was like, eh, I'm over it. And for whatever reason, I just was like, eh, I don't want to get wet. I don't want to get wet. I don't want to change my clothes. <laughs> and so am I weird? I probably am. Is anyone else like that? So I, uh, I don't know. Like with now, when I have little kids, when my kids are young, I'll go in the pool more because, you know, I want to take them in the pool and uh, play with them. But as like my older ones, 
Like, before I had my daughter, I hadn't really gone in the pool for a while. Although I will go in a jacuzzi, like at a hotel. Um, I've been trying to convince my husband. They have these jacuzzis, okay? Last year at the state fair, tried to convince my husband. And they're like a soft tub. I think they're soft, soft. I think that's what they're called, soft tub or soft something. And they're lightweight. So like we rent right now, so we could easily take it with us. It's not heavy. And then in the summer, you can use it as a pool. Like, or you know, for a little one or just to like cool off. My husband said no, maybe next year. And guess what? State Fair's not here this year. So that sucks because they do the best deals at the State Fair. Maybe next year. <laughs> All right, I'm done. I'm sorry I babbled on for 40 minutes. I apologize if, um, if you hung around until the end. Thank you. I love you guys. You're awesome. And um, yeah. All right, guys. Have a beautiful day.